Hello! Coming to you live, another wet hair vlog. I honestly, I'm trying to let it air dry and it turns out that those curly hair products that I talked about in my last vlog are actually very super helpful. Um, my hair turns out pretty wavy so those products have been um, really great for me. Okay, this vlog and probably what's going to happen is I'm going to get my nails done in like 30 minutes so I'm probably going to like not be able to finish this vlog and then I'll pause it and then I'll start refilming when I get back. So just, just so you guys know, because this is what we're dealing with right now. Hard no. And some of y'all were coming at me in my DMs about my nails from my Instagram stories. So getting them done. This vlog, if you didn't watch my last vlog, I'm going on vacation this week. I'm so excited. I've been looking forward to this vacation. Um, for quite a while. My dad is taking just me and Shayla. Um, we don't know where we're going. He's made it a surprise trip. Obviously we'll find out when we get to the airport. Um, but he's told us that we're going to a beach. So obviously we need to needed to know that to, um, to pack appropriate attire. So this vlog is going to be us going through my suitcase and seeing what I packed. He actually sent us an itinerary last night, like a very vague itinerary, um, just so we have an idea of what's going on and what we're doing. This vlog is kind of going to be like a repack situation now that I have a better idea of what our schedule for the few days are going to look like. Um, so going to go through this kind of repack with you guys, take some things out, maybe add some things in, but that's something that you want to watch. Stay tuned. Okay. And I know that's maybe isn't the best like setup, but it's the best that I can do. Also, ignore the bed i'm washing my sheets so everything's in the washer um okay so just to kind of preface um the situation so i live in san antonio or i live in bernie texas um, my dad and his wife live in georgetown which is right outside of austin so brayden is in town seeing me and we are going to drive down to austin this evening um stay with my dad tuesday wednesday um and then brayden's going to hit the road thursday going back home he's he lives in louisiana and then we, me, my dad, and Shayla will go on our trip. So um, we're gonna spend some days, a few days with my dad beforehand. Um, and so I kind of have to pack accordingly for that. I really just packed workout clothes and then I kind of figured um, if I needed to wear some of the stuff in my vacation stuff, I could just wash it and be fine because I don't want to pack too much. Okay, so I'm kind of struggling with what I want to wear to the airport. I'm thinking I have this really cute maxi dress it's from z supply i've had it for years so i probably can't link it um it's pretty long it's a little shorter in the not shorter in the front but actually it's not shorter at all i thought it was a little shorter in the front i like to knot it on the side but i'm thinking about wearing this that way i'm comfy um and it's just i like a cute airport airport fit but we're actually leaving pretty late um and we're gonna get in pretty late so um kind of tempted to just not care about what I'm wearing. I don't know, but I think I'm going to pack this anyway. I think this would be a good, um, dress to wear like after the beach. Maybe if I'm like kind of burnt, this would be really comfy and easy to wear. Okay. Moving on. Swimsuits. Um, this bathing suit. So cute. Actually, my friend gave this to me. This is from triangle. Um, and it's a little more like, wait, is that? There we go. It's a little more high waisted. Um, I like fuller coverage. I'm not a, like a thong cheeky cheeky girl. Like that's, I'm very uncomfortable for that. I do. Um, I like the imperfect in between. So this one is, is great for me. Um, but I love this. It actually, it looks like it's going to be itchy, but it's not at all, which is shocking. Cause I have a bathing suit just like this in a different color. Um, not triangle brand. Um, and it's pretty stinking itchy. I got this one from Amazon and it's a huge win. It's on my Amazon storefront. I will link it in the description, but this is super cute. It actually, so it has little like loops here and I think you're supposed to loop it through the bottom, but I just kind of like tie it like a halter and then tie it around the back like a normal bikini. Um, but super cute. This is probably the cheekiest bottoms I have um, and probably the cheekiest I'll, I'll ever go. Um, it's not bad. It's about the same as the other one. This one is a little bit more narrow though. Um, but I love this bikini. Super cute. Um, and then I'm going for like a little mango color. It's really simple. Nothing, nothing crazy, but this is cute. I figured it'd look good with some tan skin. Okay. So, so far I'm liking what I have. I'm trying to think what the itinerary was. Maybe I should pull it up on my iPad. Okay. Here we go. Here's the itinerary. 
just gonna read it out to you guys. So we'll leave Thursday evening at 7 p.m. We will arrive at like 11 p.m. and there will be a rental car. Um, we'll go check into the hotel. Um, Friday, the next day, we'll have a beach and pool day, relax, work out, lay out, eat, go out. Dinner will be at 6.30 p.m. Then we'll find like a fun bar or something along the lines of that um, and just enjoy the night. So see, it's like a very vague um, itinerary. It's not, he's not like telling me like specific restaurants because then we would know where we're going. Um, Saturday breakfast, he has booked us like an excursion. So I guess we're gonna be doing an activity together at 10. Um, and then 1 p.m. we'll work out, lay out by the pool. Um, three, around 3 p.m. we'll go shopping and then 6.30 for dinner again. And then Sunday we leave. So it's a really short trip, but it's gonna be so much fun. We have so much fun with our dad and um, we, haven't hung, we haven't gotten one-on-one -on -one time with him in a minute. So this will be really fun. And we've never done just me, Shayla, and my dad before, so. And the reason being, uh, my mom took Skyland Emma to Seaside last year. So this is kind of like our turn, if that makes sense. I will wear my dress um, Thursday and that's really it. And then we'll just have pajamas. And I'm really just packing shorts and a t-shirt and like that's it, just one pair because I don't care to rewear that. So I'll wear that. Um, and then for working out Friday, Saturday, and I really only need um, two tank tops. I'm bringing three cute little summer colors. I love these. Um, these are the new, and I say new because Lulu has had these for a long time. These are all Lululemon, um, but they've, they've made them like short and boxier now. I actually kind of preferred when they were the longer um, fit because sometimes I don't really like if they're super short and I don't really like, I don't know. I just preferred them to be longer. I'm getting used to the shorter ones, um, but know whatever um gonna pack these I do plan on working out nothing intense I kind of thought about finding an f45 I thought that would be cool and bring my dad I think he would really enjoy it but um Shayla and I just talked about just doing some cardio in the hotel just to stay active and um I don't know about you guys I mean if you like to enjoy your vacation and completely relax good for you I don't think I can do that <laughs> I actually think I would enjoy my vacation more and I do enjoy my vacations more when I do work out um it just makes me feel productive and it feels like I can enjoy my day more. I think it's just the athlete in me. Um, it's maybe not a healthy mindset to have, but it helps me be my best self. So, so tank tops, shorts. Um, okay. Bathing suit cover up. This is super cute. This is from Shein. Um, this is adorable. I wore this in Belize. Um, it looks like it's not very, let me see if I can stand up and show you. I'm probably going to be cut out of the frame, but, um, it's like, I feel like it's like the perfect length for just a cover up, um, easy to wear around the hotel and the beach and stuff. And it's breezy and not hot. So that'll be good. Um, let's see, let's see the itinerary again. Friday is pretty chill. Um, so for dinner, I have this cute top. I think this is from Urban. Nice little flowy beachy top. I think, again, this will be something fun to wear um, if I'm a little sunburnt. Um, nice and breezy and easy to wear. I just love the beach vibe. I'm so excited. Guys, I'm so excited. Okay, that's one top. Kind of the same um, idea. I love this top. I've had this top for a few years now. I got it from Nasty Gal. Um, super cute in the front. Super open in the back, which I love. Um, only thing is is it's kind of pointy like right here. So it's kind of like Kim Possible, if you know what I mean. Um, so that's not, it's not, it's flattering, but it's just, it's kind of weird. It's kind of weird there. I'm used to it. I don't care anymore, but it's, it's interesting. And then you've probably seen this on my Instagram. This is a bodysuit from Aritzia. It's so cute. I thought this would be really cute with white jeans and some platforms. So packing that as well. And I'm trying to like, trying to keep my options not too overwhelming. Like I want to pack a good bit because I do have some really cute beach clothes that I want to wear. Um, but I also want to give myself options, but I also don't want to pack too much. So kind of a interesting in between. I got this also from Shein. This is a set. So this is the top. It's obviously strapless and it stretches out. So it's a lot bigger than you think. It's just kind of smushed together right now. Um, super cute. And it comes with these little high-waisted um, like trouser shorts. And I'm bringing a steamer because I know that 
obviously all these clothes are like wrinkled in here. Um, the house stinking cute. So it'll be a little set. It's so cute. I haven't worn this yet. I got it for my trip to Belize last year. Um, or was it? No, it was this past New Year's. Oh my gosh. Um, never wore that though. So excited to wear that or try to wear that. That'll be a good, I keep saying this, but that'll be a good outfit to wear after the beach when you're like sun kissed and you don't really, especially if you're a girl, I feel like you understand when you're wearing a bikini, it feels like you're wearing a bra. Like it feels like you never took off your bra and underwear, like, right? It feels like that compressed feeling. And this, I obviously won't be wearing like a tight fitting bra. So, um, this is going to be very comfortable to wear. I feel like girls get that. I did wear this in Belize. Um, it's a, it's actually a dress. I'm trying to see how I can show this. Okay. I'll show you the, the top part. So it's like single strapped right here. So it goes like this and then there's a little cutout and then it goes like this. So super cute, super beachy, um, super wrinkly. So this is going to need to be steamed for sure. Um, but this is very comfortable as well and easy to wear. A lot of this is from Shein. Like this top, I think this is stinking cute. I think the crochet is kind of in right now and I'm really loving it. Um, this is super comfy. It's super cute. Um, I thought this would be fun with jean shorts when we go like shopping or something. Easy to wear. My favorite jean shorts. And if you are a short little gal with big legs, I get you. Um, these are from Urban. These are Levi's and I absolutely love them. I got them. Hmm maybe in the fall. And I, I got them in the fall because I was like, oh my gosh, these fit me. These are cute. I like the style. I like the length. Um, I need to snag these while I can find a pair of jean shorts that fit me. Have my steamer. I actually asked for this for Christmas. It was one of those items that like I wanted, but I didn't want to buy myself. So I just put on my Christmas list, but I don't want to unwrap it, but it's um, has a cord and it's pretty easy to use. Actually, when, when I first got it, I brought it to a wedding, like to, not to a wedding, to, um, like for a wedding to see my dress. But when we plugged it in, it's like was smoking. And I was like, oh my gosh, great. Like I have a broken steamer and it's a Christmas gift. So it's not like I can return it. Um, and it's been a few months. Um, but my mom who obviously she's a mom, so she just knows things. Um, she's like, no, it just has to like heat up and it's brand new. So it's going to smell like that. I was like, oh, okay. I just didn't want to set the hotel on fire personally. Next item. I, this is kind of like a Steve Irwin vibe, but I actually really like it. It's, um, well, let me see if I can button it up. Okay. I buttoned the bottom and the top. So hopefully that's a little better. Um, super cute. I love this. It's kind of like a linen material. Um, but yeah, it's giving, it's giving Steve Irwin, but I love it. Um, thought that would be an easy wear with some flip flops. I have just jeans, um, nothing special here. These are both from my favorite boutique called Vistique. Um, super, super cute jeans, very flattering. Um, I have have yet to have a purchase from Vistique that I didn't like. Um, and if you don't like it or if it doesn't fit right, their return process is so easy. Like they're just, this is not an ad by the way. I just love them. And if they want to collab with me, they can. Okay, this is from Altered State, a cute little mini dress. I did bring some spandex shorts to wear under it because I'm not very comfortable with um, the length of it, but it's super cute. Um, nothing special in the back, just a little cow neck. And I love the print and the, the colors. I think it's adorable. It's giving sunset. It's giving tequila sunrise. And then the last thing I have for clothes, um, I've had this little set for years, literally since college. I wore it to our first girls trip um, with a group of girls from LSU. Um, I've loved this. It's super cute. It's perfect for the beach. Um, so it's these little like parachute pants um, and they have like a little opening and then it comes with this little strapless. It reminds me of like a cupcake or something. A little cupcake top. That's what I'm gonna call it. But it's super cute. Um, which way does it go? Whatever. Anyway, super stinking cute. Looking over what I've packed, I actually feel really good about it. I don't feel like I've packed too, too much. I obviously have overpacked a little bit, but it fits in a carry-on, so I'm Gucci with that. Um, other than that, let me show you some of the accessories I'm bringing in my shoes as well. We're back. Look how fun. I'm obsessed. I wanted something like different, but I still, I don't want to go like super crazy, but I wanted something still neutral, but still fun. So I thought these were so cute and I got it on my toes too, but just solid color. No, no French tip. 
Okay, so I've already gone through all my clothes. Um, I'm gonna go through, not like toiletries, but just like accessories, like my purse that I'm bringing, um, any other just little items. So one thing I've had for a while, and I'm not really a headband girly, but I'd like to be, but I thought this was so cute. It's like a little, not wicker, cause it's soft, but like that's the vibe it gives. But I thought this was cute for the beach. Love that. Um, kind of on the wicker page. I've got these shoes like last year, maybe. Um, just some cute little block heels, strappy wicker. These actually are wicker. Um, little heels. And you guys have seen these before, but my um, clear um, platforms, I'm actually like destroying them. I don't know if you can see. Yeah, they're getting pretty, pretty dirty. Um, but I love these and I thought this was a good neutral shoe I could wear with anything to dress it up or down. And then really the only other things I'm packing, this purse I got for Easter from my dad. That is a cord for my speaker. Um, but I thought this was like a cute beachy look. Um, again, neutral so it can go with pretty much everything. Okay, I got these hats made in Mexico, or not in Mexico, for Mexico. Like we took a family trip to Mexico um, when last year, two years ago. And Skyla had to pack my bag for me because my flight got delayed. It was just a whole thing. Uh, but she forgot these hats and I got a bunch of bucket hats made that says hashtag, I don't know if you can see that, poor decisions, but P-O-U-R, like pouring a drink. Um, so I bought, or I'm bringing three, one for me, Shayla and my dad, um, just for fun, just cause I think that's funny. But that's really it. That is what I have in my suitcase. That's what I'm bringing to the beach. I am so, so excited. The next vlog you guys will probably see is the beach trip itself. So um, thanks for watching, you guys. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see y'all next time.